Hey guys, it's -a me, Mario, fan forever. And uh, for today's video, I will be doing another video of Donkey Kong Country 2 World 3. But before I get started, I want to apologize for my video from yesterday. It had some really bad lag to it, but I should have fixed it by changing some of the settings around in my OBS that I'm recording on. But yeah, anyways, uh, let's get started. So, I'll be doing World 3 Kremlin Way. World Level 1. Barrel by you. <laughs> uh, that got scared for a second. So, for this level, uh, Rambi will turn into the DK Queen once you pass by that sign that makes him disappear. So, you need to keep him alive. And these barrels with the numbers on them will start counting down, and once they reach zero, then they'll just automatically shoot you. You can also rotate them. And uh, for the first bonus in this level, there, you saw that banana arrow pointing towards the left. It basically means for you to follow this guy. You can't really see him because my face cam is blocking, but he throws a chest and you need to break the chest over on him to get a cannonball to take to the cannon. And there's actually a dragonfly over here behind my face cam. For the wasp, you have to use the cannonball to defeat it, but for your, you can use the partner comp to hit the dragonflies, just not the wasps. gotta rotate the barrels to shoot towards the next one without shooting into the water. Glimmer's Galleon. It's another water level, and the DK coin and the first bonus is all the way at the beginning over here. So that's where DK coin is, and right over here is where the bonus is, the first one. And this bonus can be pretty hard if, because it's in the dark and you can't really see well, but uh, like I said, since I've played this game so many times, Now the fun begins. So in this level we're introduced to a new animal buddy. This guy, his name is Glimmer the Anglerfish, and he only appears in this level, hence the name Glimmer's Galleon, and um, he acts as a light source view so it's easier to see in the water.
there's a DK barrel right now. Ah, uh, perfect. What do now? Here's the last bonus of this level. And uh, this bonus could be kind of tricky for those who have not played any players in this game. But I already know that, so. So moving on to one of the harder levels of the game, Crockhead Clamber. So the DK coins all the way at the beginning. You have to go backwards though. I'm gonna switch to Diddy because his cartwheel jump is like I'm more comfortable with his cartwheel jump than I am with Dixie's hair twirl. And here's the DK coin. You have to break open the chest on all four of those bees to get it. I'm gonna use Dixie for this because I'm more comfortable with Dixie because of her hair glide. Well, I'm not. It's not that more comfortable. It's just that's safer for me. I'm gonna wait for this guy. Yeah, you see, I could just like glide over these dragon plus You're usually supposed to bounce on all of them, but you know, with Dixie gl Glide, you could just skip that. And it's safer, but it's kind of slow. But yeah, because due to the delay, I'm just gonna take it safe. And there's only one bonus in this level, and it's up here. To this boss, you just gotta defeat all the bees with square. show off a little cool glitch I found out about. If you don't pass by the sign with Squitter, you'll see like this red glitched coin right there, you see it? Yeah, that happens if you don't make Squitter disappear by the sign. It doesn't do anything, but it looks kind of cool. That was close. I actually panicked a little. Alright. That was close. I almost died there. Thank goodness I didn't. But, you know, whatever. So moving on to Rattle Battle. So there's a bonus sub here, and I'm going to switch to Diddy for it because, uh, like I said, I'm more comfortable with this cartwheel jump instead of Dix's hair tool jump. It's easier for me than this bonus. No 
Okay, so for this level, the gimmick is you play as Radley the snake. This is the first level where you transform into one of your animal buddies. And you'll be playing as Radley the snake for the entire level. This stage can be kind of tricky. Especially with the delay I have, but you know. I get, I'm getting kind of used to it. Until my new capture card arrives. I ordered a new capture card. icon at the bottom left of the screen is basically your other partner just, you know, since you're an buddy. And here's the second bonus down here. If you haven't seen her play this game before, this DK coin can be uh, really tricky to find. It's right over here. Also, another thing about <sighs> yeah. another thing about Rattle is that Zipbox is kind of weird. bonus in this level. It's gonna be kinda hard because I have to collect all the stars and some stars are hidden behind the face cam. to jump on the bee, but I missed it. video anyways. But yeah, so I'm gonna move on to the second Lost World level, Black Ice Battle.
So this cannonball, I have to take to the cannon to uh, access the bonus, the only bonus in the snow. Because like I said in the previous video, every Lost World level help only has one bonus in it. to the next level, Slime Climb. So that fish in the water, it looks like one of those red fish from those water levels I've played, but it's not, it's different. He's actually invincible. start raising up so you have to move quickly. follow this line of bananas uh, downwards because that you have to use the invincibility to get to that bonus because if you go in the water with that fish without invincibility you And for this cannonball, you gotta take it to the... 
Yeah, and this is one of the punishing bonuses, because if you fail it, uh, I'll actually have to, like, die and retry. And I do not want that. And last but not least, the DK coin. And you need both Kongs to get to this invincibility barrel. And you have to take, the, use the invincibility to get to the DK coin down here. Alright, so there's one more level left to go before I do the boss. Next up is Bramble Blast. This has got one of the most iconic um, uh, soundtracks in the game. It's called Sticker Brush Symphony. And there's only three types of these levels in this game. With all these like doors and stuff everywhere. to navigate through the barrel maze to get to this bonus. And this bonus also is pretty tricky if you have it, you know. So, but since I have, uh, an easy way to remember is just to go all the way down. But don't make that mistake that I just did. I've never seen that happen before. Interesting. Yeah, let me get this DK barrel. Okay, I don't know how I died there. Usually it shoots me into that barrel above it, and then shoots me to the checkpoint. Just gonna ignore that. 
This delay, I tell you, there's a delay to the shots because of the delay I have. I try to go for a personal mess, but that's not going to happen anymore. Yeah, so for that part, you gotta jump backwards and you get on some walks. Look at this DK barrel right here. I'm proud of myself for this run right now, just saying. Oh, time to do the boss. So this is Cudgel. And, uh, he looks the same as Clubba, except he's gray, and, you know. So the thing about Cudgel is 
that once he uh, falls, you have to jump before he lands, otherwise he'll stun you. And then he'll spot a TNT barrel. And you have to hit him six times with a TNT. capture card everything should be fine but for now that's the video thank you for watching and uh, i'm sorry that i died a lot but it is what it is you know but yeah um i'll see what i do next thank you for watching and have a good day